family members are speaking out today about the death of an El Monte police officer killed in the line of duty. They say the officer never received crucial information that may have prevented his death. KTLA 5's Alina Bobian reports from El Monte. The family of Joseph Santana is essentially saying that their son had no idea what he was walking into. And had he known, well, he might be alive today. So take a look. This is a photo of Joseph Santana, an officer with the El Monte Police Department, and also his partner, Corporal Michael Paredes. Now, on June 14, 2022, the two El Monte police officers were dispatched to the Siesta Inn, where a woman there, Maria Zepeda, made a frantic 911 call about her husband, Justin Flores, a convicted gang member. The woman claimed her husband had stabbed their daughter. During the seven-minute, 20-second phone call to police, Zepeda reportedly, re repeatedly told the dispatcher, Ruth Bonneau, that Flores had a history of violence against their daughter and was under the influence of PCP and methamphetamine and was also armed and dangerous. According to Santana's family, that information was never conveyed to the two responding officers. And once they arrived at the motel, they were ambushed by the suspect who fatally shot both men before eventually killing himself. The family believes if the information regarding the suspect was accurately conveyed, their tactics and approach would have been different that day and would have led to a different outcome. I am here with the hope that those who failed my brother on that fateful day are held accountable. My brother's life matters and we will not let his memory fade away. There's a lot more to the story. Um, I can tell you that the men and women that were working that day we're doing the right thing to the best of their abilities. And take a look at this. This is in response to uh, what the family is claiming from the El Monte Police Department, saying the department continues to mourn the loss of our officers, Sergeant Michael Paredes and Officer Joseph Santana. Over the last year, the LASD and the L.A. County DA's investigators have interviewed all relevant witnesses, interviewed, reviewed excuse me, all police camera footage, CAD reports, call logs, and found no wrongdoing by our police officers or civilian personnel. We fully anticipate this finding to hold that our officers that our DA will officially clear all involved officers and close the investigation. Now, as far as the family goes, at this point, it's unclear if they plan to follow up with litigation. At this point, they just say they want awareness to be raised and for justice to be served for Joseph Santana.